Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Mari kita bincangkan example 9 yang mana kita akan gunakan equation dalam learning outcome 5.4D1 untuk selesaikan soalan ini. Soalan dia berbunyi suppose the moving road in figure 5.22. So 5.22 adalah gambar aja pada muka surat 16. Okey, yang saya lukiskan balik di dalam uh, pembentangan saya pada video kali ini. Okey, so boleh lukiskan balik gambar ni. Okey. Uh, yang mana the road is 0.1 meter long. And the velocity v is 2.5 meter per second. The total resistance of the loop is 0.03 ohm and the magnetic field B is 0.6 Tesla. Fine. Yang pertama, the motional EMF and yang kedua, the induced car, the induced current. Okay, so let's list all the info first. Yang pertama sekali, dalam soalan kita diberi length L. Okey. So panjang road kita adalah sepanjang 0.1 meter. Dan diberi juga velocity is equals to 2.5 meter per second and the resistance of the loop is 0.03 ohm. Given that the magnetic field is 0.6 tesla, we want to find the induced EMF. Induced EMF can be calculated by using equation B times L times V sin theta so blv kita sudah tahu dah pun diberi tetapi apakah dia value theta oops apakah dia value theta okey so value theta is the angle between um uh, Magnetic field B and velocity. So, in this case, the magnetic field is into the page and the velocity is moving to the right. So, the angle theta in this case is 90 degree. Therefore, induced EMF is equals to 0.6 times 0 0.1 times 2.5 sine 90 degree sine 90 is equals to 1 therefore the induced emf is equals to 0 0.15 volt jadi dalam soalan ini jangan kuatir usually angle theta memang 90 dah darjah. Kalau gambar dia macam gambar 5.22 uh, 5.22 angle theta dia adalah 90 darjah. So jangan kuatir sangat tentang angle theta bagi soalan ini. Tetapi soalan ni ada dua target. So yang pertama kita dah selesaikan induce EMF 0.15 volt. Yang kedua sekali kita nak cari induce current. Now, induced current can be calculated using Ohm's law. Induced current, uh, induced EMF is equals to current times resistance. Therefore, 0 0.15 is equals to I times the resistance is 0 0.03 Ohm. We rearrange the equation and we'll get The value for induced current I is 5 ampere. So that's all for example 9. If you have any question, so boleh tanya saya uh, dalam video uh, dalam kelas.
tutorial. Sekian, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.